Double hook up. Wow. All right, we've got two different size shads here. We're going to trim them up. I like to go under the, or above the top fin here and get rid of the belly. The belly does work for bait, cut tail, cut top fin off. Same thing down here. Got to trim the belly off. Like I said, you can use the belly for bait, it'll work, but it tends to spin your line up a little. It's like a cavity there, it catches the water, and any of the fins do the same thing in a lot of current. They will take the live bait for sure, but I do like to cut all the fins off. And um, nine odd, Damagatsi, very sharp. Four ounce weight, 80 pound eagle claw doubled up at the hook we'll hook the whole shad try to go I try to go like come out center of the eyes through the top of the head then we'll get it back here to this 100 pounder hopefully and um Use a bigger shad. You can see that's a pretty big bait there. Maybe 10 inches long. Three inches wide. This is spider wire here. I can cast the big baits further on spider wire than I can the mono. Same thing through the bottom. Now you with the eyes out top of the head. And we're fishing. Hit on that whole shot again. <laughs> that gets fun when you, they don't want to come out. Oh, oh Lord, look at that. Wow, that might be a 60 pounder. That's a pig. <laughs>
and that's how thick they are down there. So we use for bait. We hook the whole blue cat on, send them out like that. What a big boy! Hurry down. It looks like it might be a 25 or a 30. Today, double hook up, good twenty five thirty, and about a 10, 12. Ah, that's the way it's done. Sweet. Five rods out, three rods down, two left to go. He's on that back one. Oh, gosh. Got every every little thing in the river in him. Wow. 